every Thursday, we're going to bring you the best in all of the 70s, the 80s, right here on the People Station Power. And they've been doing it for 45 years, and this is how we're going to continue to do it. That's what we bring do. Bring the best of what we do. And we got celebrities in the building. For sure. We have celebrities in the building. Senator Kelvin is in the building. What's going on, man? How's it going, my man? Been listening to y'all morning. Yeah. You to this afternoon, rather, y'all. Y'all got it going. We got it going on? Yeah, I got it going on. It's only if, if you say it. The only reason why I came. Okay, all right. Yeah, yeah. That's all we got. <laughs> now, no, I, I got to talk to you, man, because I've been to this spot, man. You've been there. I've been to the spot, man. Okay, the fine. spot is hot, man. I just, I've been wanting to talk to you since I've been there. Of course, Antoine invited me over, man, and we had a little celebration. I had a little celebration over there, by, by the way. and um, Spent some money. Urban Lounge, man, is, 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 so, is so sweet because of the location. Why the location, man? Why did you pick that location to do what you do? Yeah, absolutely. What you just said, it's in the heart, 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 the heart of the art district, right, right. downtown. Uh, we wanted to be a part of that. We wanted to be a part of where it's located. We have a huge patio. Um, we just wanted to do something. There was nobody in town was doing anything for us, mm -hmm. a spot for us. Well, you know how it goes. It gets too, you know, a little bit too much R&B going on. They change up on us. So we wanted something where people can have some consistent. So. Uh, we open it up. It's and a nice spot. Have a spot for us to come to. Glad you came. Now, now, I, I ain't seen you dancing up in there yet, though. I, I'm, try, I'm trying to catch you up in the spot, you know. I know I've seen you cruise through a few times, and you, the brother's you're too busy for that. He's smooth, man. He's man. busy, man. What are you telling him? You know, he's try, trying to pass But, but you got to come on a, come on a Friday or Saturday. I might, you might catch something. So, either, you know. either that, either, either he's too busy, or I see him always sneak back there where the taco's at. Uh, <laughs> and I, dope concept, man. I mean, you, you got the taco stand in the back. The people get done partying. They're hungry. They can go right through the door. And yes, they got, but we have our own menu, too. So let make sure you know that. The taco place is my pop buddy's shop. It's his... Uh, Chris Pikes, he has tacos, where else right there, but we have our own uh, menu with burgers, fries, and wings okay. and stuff, so you can I, sit I down that, in our spot and get your own food. Yet. It wasn't open yet, so All now right, we're, so we, yeah, we, go have, we got it going we, on now. We're going we to check it out tonight? That's right. Come on. Let's do it tonight. Come on. Definitely. We're going to be there. So what you got coming? <laughs> oh my God! We can't drop, we can't Look, drop your name. I can't give you the Senate discount. That's different. Right, this, this, this ain't legislation. Come on, give us a little bit. Okay, Donald Trump. Yeah. I'm gonna call Donald Trump. Trump. I'm gonna call him Trump. <laughs> Please, Please you, use your phone when you call him. <laughs> so, what's coming up for the Urban Lounge? You know, in the next couple of weeks, man. What do you guys got? We got a bunch of stuff going on, man. You know, this past Saturday we had the fight there and. We have packed house. We, I mean, we have people are sitting on the floor, sitting oh, wow. outside the place, watching wow. from the windows. Um, and so, you know, like I said, just please. We got tonight. We got our comedy night. Um, we got, you know, Todd Tucker in town to kind of help highlight, highlight that with us tonight. Fridays we're in the heart right, of the right. district, and first Fridays we usually just kill down there. I haven't so. experienced it. What is the first Friday like on at, at the club? First okay. Friday they have probably about 30, 40 vendors down there, food trucks and stuff, all throughout that little section where we're at. Um, and people wow. just walk all throughout. They, See, that's you know, crazy. Because I'm driven by there. Yeah, and, and not really what knew the heck what is going was. on? Exactly. So now yeah. I know. Now you know. Now you know you can stop. You didn't know what it was. You thought they was giving away government cheese, but no. Hey, ain't nothing wrong with that. I grew up for that. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Tell me about it. Makes the best cheese sandwich, don't what? it? What? Yeah. Stop and go and chill out to, at the Urban Lounge on First Friday. That's, that's, that's what I That's what it's there for. Yeah, yeah. And then Saturday we got Black and White Night, night that I'm presenting. So yeah, we got stuff all the time. Sunday we got Watch Party. What is that, Powers or something? Somebody yeah, contacted want to do yeah, a, uh, well, a show watch party there, so we'll do that. We do that almost lounge. anything. We do everything at the lounge. For right. sure, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, well, listen, I heard you say tonight you got my man Todd Tucker in the building. Todd Tucker. And we got Todd Tucker in the building, and I'm just telling you, y'all. What's going on? What's up, people? Todd, Todd, they don't, they don't know how people just drop through Power 88, man, because, you know, this, you know we, we, I think we got a magnet, man, just to bring the stars to the building, man. What's up with you, bro? Hey, man, I'm in town. I'm here to turn up at uh, Urban Lounge tonight, so I hope everybody come out because we're going to do it, right? ATL style. We're going to bring ATL to uh, to Vegas. Wait a minute. You just told me you was from New York. Yes. <laughs> I'm, I'm in NY all day, but I live in Atlanta, I'm so. About, I'm about to stop. I'm about to go to the mall. I'm about to get you a hat. We're going we gonna to turn up. We're going to turn up. We're going to do it. Peace up. Eight count down. That's what we're about to do tonight. It's about to go down, y'all. Yep. <laughs> sure. So how, how you been? How you been uh, were you out here for the fight? I wasn't out here for the fight, couldn't afford it, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> stayed, I understand. Stayed, stayed home in Atlanta, you know, uh, went to a fight party. It was a great fight. Mayweather did his thing, you know what I mean, as as we expected. All right. Well, now, I know you um, You have a very extensive background, man, in the uh, uh, entertainment industry, man. And, uh, where, where, where are you going next with your, with your ventures, man? I know you got a lot of things in the 
A lot of sticks in the fire. What's going on with Ty? Yeah, I'm um, developing a couple of shows for a couple of networks, but right now my focus is on a movie that I'm working on. It's about the sex trade in Atlanta. It's a deep topic, so I'm yeah. trying to I'm trying to get it right. You know what I mean? Because you got to come right when you attack a to uh, topic like that. So right, that's right. what I'm working on now. Awesome, awesome. So you just you gonna you gonna be in the house tonight? And um, I'm in the house, man. What? Wife, wifey gave me a pass. You know what I mean? <laughs> you know she's like, I'm go on, do your thing. Can he get you a pass? She even she even posted she even posted the flyer. You know what I mean? <laughs> Go hang out with my baby. You know, I've been loud. See how You know, you know what? what? I, I I used to work for So So Deaf. I was okay. there when your wife got signed to So So Deaf. I was actually right. staff producer there, and and those man, that girl went from boom boom boom. I mean, when I mean when I tell you, she I didn't even know she wrote the way that she wrote. But when I found out what she was doing behind the scenes as Escape was being developed into the group that they were. I was like, wow, then boom, all at once, she's writing for TLC, writing for everybody, man. I didn't understand it even when I got with her, you know what I mean? I was like, oh <laughs> shit, you did all of that? <laughs> <laughs> she, she, she really, she really, she really blossomed on her own, you know what I mean? And I mean, of course, there was so much going on. I heard I heard our music scene down there has tremendously changed studio-wise and everything, but I was working with Dallas at the same time, too. And she started showing up at sessions over here, and I was like, oh, she she in the mix. She's in the yeah, mix. Yeah. Great talent, man. Yeah, Great talent. Yeah. Just wanted to congratulate her, man, because she, she's done her thing in this industry for sure. Yeah, she has some plaques that I didn't even know. I was like, oh, you wrote that? That yeah. too, you know? Yeah. She's done her thing. Yeah. yeah. So look, y'all tell us where, give us a location, give us a time, let the people know what time they need to be there for everything jump off, and uh, you know, we hey, gonna roll with we it. We look at it right on the corner of Charleston and Art Street, 107 uh, right 107 East, East Charleston, right on the corner, uh, Suite 107. We have that huge outside patio, you'll see it lit up. Um, and come on in, you know, if you've never been before, I promise you it'll be a treat. Uh, yeah. People barely have been enjoying themselves. Eight and the festivities begin at 8 o'clock? 8 o'clock. Doors open. Mr. Axon, let us know how, is, is there a way that people can get on to urbanlounge.com or anything, any social media okay. stuff so they can keep track of what's happening at your place? Thanks a lot for that. Yeah, just go to our, we have a page. Um, and I got to admit, man, that's been going very, very, very well. But it is yes. the Urban Lounge Las Vegas, just spelled out. Um, get on to there, and it'll take you to any one of our social media networks. Go on to our, we also have a website, uh, 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 The Urban Lounge, D Downtown Las Vegas. Um, log on to there. Again, we'll take you to any one of our sites. It'll take you to our Instagram site, Twitter, anything. Uh, follow us. Uh, we all, as you asked earlier, what's going on? All of that stuff, we are very good with our social media, um, and I think that's how we've grown so fast. Uh, social media nowadays, um, and it's something. Um, you can put anything up, friends share it, other people share it, um, and we've been doing very well with that, so follow us. We got you. Right there. Todd, you got anybody you want to shout out in the, in the ATO, man? You know, I know they, they, they listening on our app. They got <laughs> hey, I, want to, I want to shout out Wifey, you know, and... Uh, I'm in good hands, babe. I'm in good hands. Don't be tripping. Oh, he's in good hands. He's in good hands. <laughs> what about Ace? Sure. Shout out my little man Ace. And, uh, yo, just come kick it with me tonight, man. At Urban Lounge, we're going to have a good time. I'm ready to turn up LV Las Vegas style. I'm ready to do it. And let everybody know how they can hit you up on your social media platforms as well. Todd, T-O-D-D-167 on Instagram. DM me about business and nothing else. I'm good. Hey, <laughs> Todd, tonight, this is what it's going to be. The Bomb Squad, we're going to be in the building. That's what's but, up. But me and you, we're going to show them how the A-Town style. They ain't ready for that. <laughs>